this month on NRN's In The Mix. The chicken category in general is very, very popular. How popular? Well, let's take a look at Chick-fil-A. This brand did almost $22 billion in U.S. sales. And that's massive considering. Chick-fil-A only has about 3,000 locations. It comes as restaurants continue to digitize to win over customers and not just chicken lovers. Wingstop CEO Michael Skipworth chats about the brand's new online ordering platform, My Wingstop. And so this is actually going to allow us to continue to acquire more data on our guests, but then lean in and actually use that data to personalize that guest experience. And a new salty brew for coffee. Ziggy's Coffee. And again, I'm like, really? Are you joking me? They say that they're adding pickle juice to their coffee. And actually, they were joking. It's April, the month of April Fools, and this is NRN's In The Mix. This is Alicia Kelsa, I'm the executive editor of Nation's Restaurant News. I am in Dallas, and I am getting ready to tour the Velvet Tacos headquarters, okay. so come with me. All right, so we have the Pride Brunch Burger featuring uh, our tie-dyed waffle tortilla, uh, a Kobe burger patty, a lemon chili aioli, uh, tater tots, bacon, there's gonna be a fried egg, candied pepitas, and green onion. Velvet Taco recently opened its 46th location, and the challenge now is maintaining all of that uniqueness you just saw as it scales. Read how the chain is tackling that challenge in Alicia's latest piece. Now to NRN's editorial director, Sam Okus. He shares data from Technomic about Chick-fil-A's eye-popping sales data. This brand did almost $22 billion in U.S. sales. So that makes it the third largest chain by U.S. sales behind only McDonald's and Starbucks. Um, but, you know, to put this in context, Chick-fil-A only has about 3,000 locations. So McDonald's has about 13,000 locations and Starbucks has about 16,000 locations. According to the company's franchise disclosure documents, Chick-fil-A is doing over $9 million per restaurant at its non-mall location. So again, for context, McDonald's does about $4 million per location and the average in the fast food space is usually between one and $2 million. But if you look at the chicken category, you can also see why some of this popularity is happening. The chicken category in general is very, very popular. We end with NRN's Ron Ruggles, who chats with Wingstop CEO Michael Skipworth about the brand's new online ordering platform. What does this mean for the brand's push to become fully digital and what's it doing with all that data? Let's listen in. Ron, Michael Skipboard, CEO of Wingstop, and we couldn't be more excited about the launch of My Wingstop next week. This is something we've invested in over the last three years, and we're really excited about how this is gonna be a step forward and really enable us to continue our journey to digitizing every transaction. We sit at 67% digital today. This is gonna allow us to lean into hyper-personalization and continue to drive consideration conversion, and ultimately frequency with our digital guests over time. We're really excited about protecting and investing in a digital business that is now over $2 billion. You've been testing this in 150 restaurants for how long? We've been in tests for a few months now in over 150 restaurants. The test has been going great. We're really excited about the early results and we feel like we've created a pilot program that gives us a lot of confidence going into the launch next week. And what kind of data are you most excited about getting from this new My Wingstop program? We've, we've actually amassed about a, a database of over 40 million users strong, and we've invested in that data. And so this is actually going to allow us to continue to acquire more data on our guests, but then lean in and actually use that data to personalize that guest experience as they engage with our brand digitally. So that's a look at this month in the mix. For more coverage like this, be sure to check out NRN.com. Till next time, I'm Diana Blass.